And hundreds of parishioners offered prayers and support for one Maryland runner injured in the Boston Marathon bombing. Erica Brannick is still recovering tonight in a hospital in Boston. Our complete coverage continues with Gigi Barnett. When the Boston Marathon bombs exploded last week, 29-year-old Erica Brannick was caught in the blast. The damage was so severe, doctors were forced to amputate her left leg. Now, as she heals in a Boston hospital, members at her church, Trinity Episcopal in Towson, believe their prayers will help. We were very shocked and concerned, and um, we're just praying for her, and we hope for the best. And hope she'll be very well. Fellow members say they're doing everything they can to help the Brannick family. Last week, the congregation held a special vigil for the runner and her sister, who was also wounded in the double bombing. It is so very important that, that people express their community in this time and that we lean on each other in these, in these horrible times. Brannick is a preschool teacher here at the Trinity Episcopal Children's Center, where parents and teachers have set up a medical fund in her honor. We just wish Erica the best and her family, and we're doing all kinds of things to help them. And keeping hope for Brannock's healing. In Towson, I'm Gigi Barnett, WJZ Eyewitness News. And the church is also planning a blood drive in honor of Brannock. As soon as they get that planned, we'll let you know about the date.